So I just got a call about a about a deer going through a window at one of the buildings that I oversee. Um, so I'm going over there now and check it out, see what's going on. I'm not sure if the deer is still there. Um, if the deer is still there, um, then of course you you know we'll we'll make good use of it. But um, but if not, at least we can get everything cleaned up and everything like that. So I'll um, I'll hit y'all back shortly as soon as I get there and see what's going on. So I can't film the location. Um, they weren't able to get the the deer out of the building, uh, and he said he was able to go across. I mean, you can see he's he's bleeding pretty good, but he said he was able to get to get the deer to go out of the other side of the building here. And and again, this is pretty good blood here. Able to get him to go out the building and back across the woods. So um, I don't see any blood right off the hand, but I'll do a little looking around to see if I can see anything. Um, Cause this would be um, it'd be some good meat. Let's try to see what the deal is here. So I found some blood. Now uh, he is bleeding, but not super bad. So I'm a I'm gonna run this little blood trail here and see if I can find anything. Not that a deer can't do it, but that's a that's a tall fence there. Keep my eyes open there. Okay, I'm still I'm still trailing blood here. That's the last blood right there that I see. This is over the fence. So I'm still seeing a drop. A drop every once in a while. Here. But it's faded off though. It's just faded off. You know. Alright, I'm still following blood here. But my guess is, man, if this was a buck and he was in rut, man, that's a tough joker right now. Still wet. Let's keep going. going into some pretty thick stuff here so that deer could be anywhere down here he's he's ran this edge of this fence down here keep my eyes open good news bad news the fence ends right here and He came down to the end of that fence right there. I'm sure if y'all can see the end of that fence right there. And crossed on over. I don't 
don't see anything so far. So I tracked them right to the edge of this property here, right here at this, at this property fence. He's still bleeding, but it may be just a, where he bust that nose. Um, I mean, he, he lost a lot of blood. There's no doubt he lost a lot of blood. And what time is it? Yeah. So I'm not sure, guys. Just not sure. Alright guys, I'm gonna wrap it up here. I tracked the devil out of that deer boy. I tracked him and he he took it probably about 150 yards. And of course, once it went to the once it got off of the property, uh, you know, obviously I had to stop. Um do I think the deer is gonna be okay? Well, guys, we, you know, it's a deer. Them jokers is tough. God knows, and I don't know the size of the deer. I don't know if it was a buck. I don't know if it was a doe. Uh, if it was a buck, you know, that, that deer is, is probably souped up right now from the rut. And um, and he can take it. You know, old deer, he can get hit and get back up. He can get shot and get back up. But um, I enjoyed that. I tracked that deer literally onto somebody else's property. And um, when, it, when I was, it looked like he was walking I can just tell by the way the blood is dropped. The blood was dropping versus splattering. And when you see it get get splattered, um, you know, look at the splatter. And you can tell the way the deer is going. If the splatter is is, is splattered out, well, then the deer is going to be going the way the splatter is going. Um, anyways, that was awesome, guys. Um I, again, I, I think the red is here. Full moon last night. I mean, bright and full. Um, the conditions are, are, you know, I think they're a little bit warm. But I'm not the deer out there mating. I think they, I think there is live action right now, and especially with Halloween coming up. By the time Halloween get here in, in another four days, I think it's going to be wide open. Especially if these temperatures drop, it's going to be 80 degrees this weekend, and we're going out this weekend. But um, it, it's, it's, it's hot. Them deers might not even care about it. I know I wouldn't. <laughs> anyway, all right, guys, live action. We'll see you in the woods.